All right, everybody, welcome back to the channel. This is Ken, and I got a project I gotta get done for my wife today, or at least get it started. It's kind of a gloomy day. It rained already once. Um, they were calling for it, some thunder showers. They said they were supposed to be pretty severe. Uh, I think they were. We had a lot of puddles when I woke up this morning after work. And, uh, but now the ground is starting to dry out, but it's still kind of gray and gloomy out, as you can see. I got a project that I gotta get done. I want to make life easier for her on watering our one garden where we have all our herbs and that, and I'll show you what we're going to water up or get set up for water uh, micro irrigation. I got all my parts. I went shopping this morning, and let's go through the parts. And I'll tell you what we're going to do and how we're going to use them. Of course, I got the assistants uh, with me. There's Minnie. There's Bear. Bear Doomy does best to chomp on that ball. Mini circles the grapes uh, constantly until she drops the ball and then we can throw it for her. So uh, I have the black polyvinyl tubing. It's uh, there's 100 feet of it. I don't need all of that, but it's half inch in diameter and internal diameter. I have 90 degree elbows and I'll show you where those are going to really gonna come into play. I got a T adapter so I can split the line and break two different lines, one to the front, one to the back. And again, you'll see that. The irrigation spikes, and these are where the uh, heads attached to, okay, um, you can see that's the flow control, that's where the uh, tip goes, and these are the tips I'm going to use the spinners, 360 degree spinners for that. That's Those are the adapters that go into the polyvinyl tubing to the quarter inch vinyl tubing, and then I got pipe cutters to make the connection, to make the pipe cuts nice and square, make it look nice. So let's go over to where the garden is, and or I'll start from the very beginning from the faucet and work, work my way down and show you what we're going to do. Hope this makes your life easier. I'm all about making things a little easier, a little more productive, etc. Okay. Here's where our spigot is. I'm going to have a, I can just use a regular hose to about here somewhere in this area, not crucial where it goes. I'll have an adapter for the threaded hose to the polyvinyl tubing. And I think I'm just gonna kinda arc, arc the tubing around the back. I don't wanna use too many bent, too many 90s, but if I have to, I will. And these are where we have some sunflowers. There's a mix there. There's Russian Giants and some other ones. Life and Farmland uh, sent me the uh, Russian Giants. I'm looking forward to seeing how big they get. So right along this fence line, house line, right in here, the black polyvinyl tube is going to come down. Then I'll put a, I'll put a, a, I'll put a 90 on it. It'll kind of go like that behind the monster blackberry bush, as we call it. And then I'll put one of those irrigation spikes back there with a, uh, either a 360 head or a 180 degree head on it, and it will allow the water to go right to the plant. And then I gotta bring that poly tubing up along my Bilco doors. That's where those four 90 degree elbows are gonna come in. You're gonna have one elbow like that there, and then one on the ground like that there on either side to get that tubing to, for the tubing to come up around and over the Bilco doors. This is the herb garden that you, in a previous video you saw me get this ready for her with the mantis and some manure and peat moss. Probably right around in here, I'm gonna take and put that T connector on and bring a line down to here and then a 90 across the front and then straight along the back so I can get everything covered in here. I'll probably put maybe one 360 spinner there to cover everything there. Uh, maybe one in there, and then two here. I'm not sure if I'll have to put a second um, sp uh, spike adapter with a 180 degree flow thing right here to cover that plant. Overall, you know, this will be a decent project for me. Something I can do after work uh, and only getting a few hours of sleep so I can get flipped back to sleeping during the night and up during the day. 
Um, we got a lot of lettuce in that garden that's pretty good. We've been harvesting it already and eating it. So got some tomato plants in there. They're looking pretty good. And you can see right there, right in here is where I got to get that polyvinyl tubing to come up and down and use those elbow connectors. So I'm gonna start making that piece first. I'll have you over here with me, and uh, we'll get it. Go we'll get moving on this. Get you locked in the tripod here, so I can get going on some of this. Hey, looking at what I gotta get behind the monster here. Um, gonna have a little bit of a problem, uh, but we'll make do. See what we can get done here. You can see the tubing in there. It kind of wraps around the bush, the plants. Comes out right there. This end, I'll put the adapter for the hose on it. I have one I'm not using right now. It's attached to another tubing. And then the poly tubing coming up over here and then going down the other side, right there. So now I gotta get in here and make some quick measurements and start that piece off. Sorry about the jostling. Again, I'm kind of doing this by myself. So let's get the tape measure. Oh, let's make a quick measurement here. Make... So, kind of measure. feet. Okay. Another 12 feet. So, so I have a sprinkler right there. You can see the little green knob. I have another one in with the lettuce and uh, tomatoes. And I have one over here by the the herbs. I'm sorry. I have one to get in behind the monster bush here. As you can see, she's a pretty big bush. Lots of blueberries, or I'm sorry, blackberries. Not gonna show you me, not gonna show you me climbing way back there and doing that. So I uh, gonna stop this video here. I'm gonna finish that up. Uh, I think you get the idea of me putting the Coupler into the polyvinyl tubing, the quarter inch tubing to the sprinkler head, 
It's gonna be the same thing. I just gotta crawl into that monster bush again and do it. So I really appreciate your time watching this video. Enjoy your day or night if you're watching this at night time. If you like the channel, please subscribe. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up. And if you wanna get notified of new videos, hit the little bell next to the subscribe button and you'll get notified. Uh, there's a couple, I think there's just three settings. There's some notifications, all notifications and none. I would hope you pick all, but I understand if you don't. And I will see you on the next video. Thank you.